everybody. Here is just a fun little summer video, um, a little bit quirky. I did it for a vintage um, challenge with the nail team, inspired by my lovely Nessa and our camper van. So I hope you enjoy it. It's using all Halo gel polishes um, and yeah, just a little bit of fun. So it's a step by step. So I've done it with pictures. Um, just thought I'd give you a little explanations. Um, this is French white in the background. Then in with my mini 3D brush and powder blue to um, paint in the sky, which I've done quite roughly, really, to give it a bit of texture in different places, clouds showing through. Then next here, we've got um, Halo's blue to um, make a C. I've cured in between each color here as well. Um, and then the sand here is Lardy Da. Um, you can see where I'm going here, and I'm kind of making like a little scene or overall five nails. Then I add in a little bit of celebration onto the sand just to make it sparkle and then add in touches of white and the darker blue just to bring it to life, put any little bits of shading in and then here with the white background of the base of the camper van I then add in burnt orange to build the bottom half of the camper van. Then the lights, I've added on the lights here and I've done white in the background first and then painted on saffron on top after it was cured. Then with my short zero brush, I have gone in with charcoal grey and done the outlines of the camper van, the windows, the, win the uh, windscreen wipers. Then I've gone onto this first little nail on the side here and I've just decided to do some like colourful uh, houses down the street, like a little path um, in the colours, um, turquoise and neon pink and saffron. Then I've done a little surfboard in white and orange, tying in all the colours together. And the last nail here, I've done some little beach hats in neon pink and uh, turquoise. And then to tie it all in, I thought with all the same colours that we've used, I will tie it in with some bunting, very vintage, um, and just goes together really well using turquoise and the burnt orange, saffron, blue and um, neon pink. And then we've done a matte top coat because I just thought that matte really fitted nicely um, with the whole vintage theme. So it's just really quick. Um, I hope you have lots of fun with it. Can't wait to see what you lot produce. Um, just, yeah, something a bit alternative. Right, thanks guys, bye.